Tyler and I not only continued our weekly pillow fights, they gained an audience. Soon spectators were asking if they could go next, until eventually we had a whole group of pillow fighters. When we started had been on the tip of everyone's tongue, we just gave it a name, Pillow Fight Club. We moved out of the parking lot and into a garage next to the bar. Each week, Tyler would read the rules we both decided on. Rule one, Pillow Fight Club. You do not talk about Pillow Fight Club. Rule two, you do not talk about Pillow Fight Club. Rule three, if someone says stop, goes limp, taps out, fight's over. Rule four, only two people to a fight, only one fight at a time, fellas. Rule five, if this is your first night at Pillow Fight Club, or you have a girly pillow, You've got to fight. The Pillow Fight Club, nothing was solved, but at the same time, nothing mattered. I used to try my hardest to look respectable, but now I just didn't care what anyone thought of me. I guess after being in a few pillow fights, you start to look at things differently. Hello? Hi, this is Marla. Who? You know, the girl from the picnic table. Why are you calling me? Well, I was just thinking about how you couldn't sleep. Okay. I'm just, I've had a lot of uh, caffeine and, and a lot of sugar, so I, I can't sleep. Um, congratulations. I don't know if this is me trying to keep myself awake on purpose or if it's just a cry for help, but uh, I was thinking maybe we could go somewhere and hang out. Like, um, we could go to the park and uh, maybe the playground. And um, we could go on the you know, swings, and we could play in the sandbox, and, and in the fountain, and we could go on the What are you doing here? What? This is my house. What are you doing in my house? Oh, oh man, you got some fluffed up friends. <laughs> when did you meet her? I don't know. Uh, I'm practicing my pillow kung fu. I saw the What's phone the was off the hook. The jungle gym and we could. Uh slide on the slides. Yeah, maybe we could uh, run bear. Marla became coming over on a nightly basis. Give me Jack.
at night, all I could hear was the two of them shouting, Yahtzee, go fish. Time's up, you're such a cheater. It made me sick. What's this? Too young. I'm sorry. You're not in. If the applicant looks too young, say he's too young, he looks too old, too old, too fat. Wait, what applicant? The applicant can stay outdoors for three days without encouragement, nourishment, or the use of his pillow, and then his training can begin. Wait, what training? You ain't even got the arms to swing a pillow, you're a disgrace. Get off my porch. Don't worry, I'm not gonna yell at you, I'm just cleaning up. I think you're getting in that house. Got news for you. You're not. You like lollipops? What are your feelings on full male frontal nudity? I didn't think so. You're not allowed in here. You'll never get in here. Two black shirts. Yes, sir. A pair of black pants. Yes, sir. Black combat boots. Yes, sir. Forty pajamas. Yes, sir. Gave me up. I didn't know what Tyler was planning. I only knew it was something big. You want to see me? I found this in the copy machine. Do you know anything about this? The first rule of Pillow Fight Club is you do not talk about Pillow Fight Club. The second rule of Pillow Fight Club is you do not. What is this? You know, I'd be careful who I go to with that, because whoever did it could be dangerous. He could take something like a, maybe a pillow and just go from cubicle to cubicle, knocking off his co-workers one by one till eventually he leads all the way up to you. Or maybe you just shouldn't come to me with every piece of trash you find. Well, I'm sick of your absenteeism and your unacceptable appearance. I see no reason to keep you around. You're fired. You know, I got a better idea. How about I work as an outside consultant? If you keep me on the payroll, I do this completely for my home. I don't even have to come into the office. Who the hell do you think you are? That's it. You're out of here. I'm calling security. It was this very moment that I had perhaps the best idea I've ever had in my life. What the hell is the matter with you? Why'd you do that? What? What? reason I thought of the first fight between me and Tyler. Look, just do what I say, and you'll never have to see me again. Oh thank you, Mr. Here, please don't leave me again! Celebration. I'll get those for you, sir. Hey, look, it's us. These recent acts of vandalism have been found to be committed by an underground pillow fighting organization. There's a full investigation underway, and results will be coming shortly. What'd you guys do? Sir, in Project Mayhem, you don't ask questions. I felt completely out of the loop. 